Ibachilia. Today, I'm going to take on, and well, to me, it's got a big of a challenge. A sachet of chilli sauce from a Bombay Bad Boy pot noodle. As you can see, it is still completely full, it's never been opened. <coughs> so I'm going to see just how hot it isn't when I eat it. Although it looks reversed due to like the camera, but like that's it's just a tickle, super saucy. I don't know why you would put literally about that much in a pot noodle, like do not know. Either way, here it goes. Get a turd open there. Now I'm gonna go like this so you can see us yet. All over my tongue. Very little left in there. If I can get the rest out. You can see that's completely flat. I've completely drained it off source. Surprisingly that's not as hot as what I thought it would be. I know it's, it's got hot to be anyway but. It doesn't even tickle my tongue. I remember when I was a kid though. Bombay bad boy pot noodle with that sauce and it was really 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 hot and just the sauce on its own was enough to send us running straight for the milk however I've just ate a chilli con carne which is like a million times hotter than that that was with fresh scotch bonnet added in as well so that's nothing I think next video I'm going to do, I'm going to, yeah, Harbonara sauce, I think is going to be the one. I've got two different varieties. I can either do the, the red, the red Harbonara sauce, it's like a hot sauce, or this behind yellow Harbonara sauce. So, yeah, next time I'll be doing that. So that was just basically a little basic start of some sorts. That was like, not even a scratch. I've had jalapenos which were hotter than my thing. In that same, so that's a jalapeno. Uh, shit. So yeah, tune in next time when I have some harbinara sauce.